Well, I was, I'm very, very pleased to have been invited to be a part of Hip Hop Speaks to Children. Dominique Rocca, who is the publisher of, uh, of source books, and I worked together on, uh, hip, on, on Poetry Speaks to Children. And it was a, a, a wonderful book, it was a good book, and it took poetry to another level of urban youngster. And Dominique and I were talking, and I thought, well, yeah, I like poetry, I write it, but what about hip hop? Nobody in our generation has been doing much with hip hop. So I like hip hop. I grew up uh, not at all with that. I'm old school. If you listen to my iPod right now, you're listening to, you know, SOS, I'm, 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 I'm old disco. But I like what the kids were doing. I, I remember the Sugar Hill Gang, you know, Hotel, Motel, Holiday Inn. And I thought something is happening. It's 40 years from now. 40 years ago, a sound came in. And I thought it was time that the so-called cultural warriors got involved. We like it because it's beautiful. We wanted to find what is the key in hip hop. And the key is a hard word that actually Dominique and Todd Green, my editor, wouldn't let me use. Key is vernacular. Hip hop is a vernacular. One of the things that disturbed me, that, that probably disturbs any parent or grandparent uh, about hip hop, is some of the um, salacious uh, uh, images that you can get and you know that those kind of images are not real because they cannot take place in the square you cannot have uh, a, a, a gentleman and his jet plane in the square let alone all of those young women coming out of the swimming pools dripping water that's embarrassing and so we wanted to identify and I thought that we should that which was embarrassing and and separate it from that which is good come. We had Oni Lasana, the storyteller, and she's going to rap for us, We Wear the Mask. We wear the mask that grins and lies, and we're going to rap Dunbar. I, of course, got the pleasure of hand-boning, because hand-boning is a part of that vernacular talk. I got the pleasure of hand-boning Gwendolyn Brooks, We Real Cool, We Skip School, We Strike Straight. So we wanted to put the cultural cloth on this wonderful hip-hop doll, as it were. I thought that parents should know that there's a lot of good and a lot of important work in here. As an artist, I applaud. I mean, I, we've got Lauren Hill, and I love Lauren Hill. And of course, my girl, Queen Latifah. And that's just, uh, you just can't beat it. Here's Lauren. You just can't beat it. We put out a call to the uh, hip-hop artists, and you see what, what the book looks like, because they, uh, they recognize, as they said, or they, what is the word? They present. And so the book is a beautiful, fun book. I think that librarians, I think that, that parents, I think that kids. It's a multimedia, so we also have a CD is there, and the CD is going to, it's right on the inside. CD will not be sold separate, of course, from the, from the book. So we were able to get the cooperation of the hip hop artists that we wanted you to hear. I'm extremely, extremely pleased to offer this book. The girls in the circle have painted their toes. They twisted their braids with big yellow bows. They took grandmother's face powder and powdered each nose and sprayed evening in Paris all over their